Hi there, welcome to Gwern Tisa Holiday Cottage. My name's Wayne and this is Julie, uh, who own the cottage. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> yeah. um, we've put a little uh, video together um, for you to see exactly what we've got to offer. Um, if you've been to Holiday Cottage before in Derry, um, I hope you enjoyed yourselves and uh, hopefully we'll see you again. Uh, otherwise, please take a look at our video and uh, give us a ring. And if you want any further information, uh, we'll only gladly give you it. Thank you. Here we are, just a couple of yards from the Holiday Cottage, um, just up the hill, down the views, down the valley towards Cardiff and Barry. You can see the landscape, um, just a small number of farms in the distance and one or two friendly neighbours uh, situated around our family home and the Holy Cottage Gwern Tisaf. This is just a few yards on the same hill as you can see in the distance. Again we've got Barry, Cardiff, just over that hill there you have Pont de Preeth and the A470. All this is farmland around the Holy Cottage and there you can see it there nestled in in the valley surrounded by uh, walkways and farm fields. Looking round now towards the heads of the valley and the Brecon Beacons and that's the very valley that uh, Derry is nestled in between. There are some of the houses. Again it's within walking distance uh, but it is down to a steep hill. This just gives you a flavour of the many walkways, fields, paths that we've got. Um, again, within walking distance and yards of the Holiday Cottage. In this direction, you've got uh, Barguide, and that's the main road out of Derry. When you stay at uh, Guernsey East of Holiday Cottage, you think you're miles away from anywhere. But just over the hill, again where they walk distance, is the village of Derry. The road you can see then is leading out towards Barguide and eventually Blackwood and down to Newport and Seven Bridge. It's nestled in between uh, two valleys and was formerly um, a village constructed really for Ogilvy Colliery. There you can see the Derry General Stores and Post Office. And further up the valley then, that's towards the heads of the valley. This is about 10-15 um, minutes walk from the cottage, um, close to Bargoid and Bargoid Golf Course and Healdy Comprehensive School. Again, surrounded by beautiful countryside. Um, this road is very quiet and it's, it's, it's lovely to take the dog or just take a gentle stroll. This is a view taken directly from the road just past Barga Golf Club. Again, these narrow lanes all sort of uh, lead to nice walking areas. And just in the village there, in the distance, you can see the village of Derry nestled between two valleys. There's the beautiful village of Derry, again nestled in between the valleys. And look in the distance, uh, you can see the Brecon Beacons. This is approximately 15 minute drive from the Holly Cottage. This is a beautiful shot of the village of Derry, nestled between the two valleys created by uh, the ice glaciers. In the distance there you can see the hills of um, the Brecon Beacons and just flying above the head there I think you can see um, a buzzard coming in, in and out of the shot. We regularly visited by kites, buzzards, and loads of wildlife that just passed the cottage door. Along the walkway from uh, Derry to Bargoid Golf Course is this watering hole we stop at with a dog and uh, this comes down the valley, a nice little brook. This is part of uh, Park Humdara National Park and stretches the whole length of uh, Derry and again this is just just a beautiful spot nestled in between the valley called Devil's Quarry. Lovely place to stop, 
have a little sit down and just watch the water trickling down. This beautiful shot is of the waterfalls uh, about 10-15 minutes walk from the holiday cottage. Part of Parkham Darren National Park. It really is beautiful on a hot summer's, summer's day. Um, take your shoes and socks off and just go paddling in the ice cold water. This beautiful view of a cascading water uh, coming down in between the valleys is part of Parkham Darren National Park, 10 minutes from the Holiday Cottage. This path is part of the Parkham Darren Country Walks, which goes past the Babbling Brook. It's a beautiful part of the area and goes down to the old railway line leading up to the visitor centre. This beautiful scene just shows you where Devil's Quarry is right in front there and the valley where the brook comes down. Again, that's another path leading up to the village and the main road leading out of the village to Bargoid. There you can see Devil's Quarry where we've seen the babbling brook coming down. Um, there are three walkways here, the railway line, the main road and another path. This is the village then of Derry leading up to the heads of the valley, Rumney Gwent. This shot shows you the beautiful scenery leading up to the Brecon Beacons. You can just see the hills there in the foreground. The village of Ochru nestling uh, in the valley. That's all you can see is beautiful countryside. This is all common land used to graze sheep and different cattle. Pentoin, Ochru and the heads of the valley uh, are leading up to that road. Panning around we are heading towards again the Holiday Cottage which is 10-15 minutes walk to this exact point. There we can see Brecon Beacons again in the distance. From exactly the same point just a few yards down the hill uh, as you can see that's uh, me doing what I usually do that's sitting around not doing a lot. That is actually me uh, my nephew Daniels who's taken the shots um, has, has got me sort of uh, in view with his video camera. This is Parkham Darren and I'm overlooking the main lake. This is a beautiful shot of the valley of Derry. You can see the overlooking farm cottages, farmlands, the manager's cottage, the old pit house manager. In between the valley there is nestled is Parkham Darren and the main lakes. Parkham Darren is now a country park which was once Ogilvy Colliery an ugly scarred land but now it's actually beautiful land looking up towards the Brecon Beacons. There are many walkways here through the countryside up through the hills along the lakes up and down the valleys and mountains. There's picnic areas and a visitor centre for you to visit. You can either access this uh, on foot and this is about um, 10 minutes, 15 minutes walk from uh, the holiday cottage or take your car down there, park it up and just enjoy the day, especially on a nice sunny day like today. You can do fishing and you can obtain fishing permits from the post office in the village of Derry. I think you'll agree this is worth its visit on its own. This is a shot looking up the valley towards the visitor centre over the main lake. Here you can see people fishing and permits are available for fishing from the post office in the village of Derry. Here you can see uh, people actually walking around uh, the main lake at Parkham Darren. They've got some beautiful footpaths all level uh, you can actually take your bike there, push push bikes and prams. As you can see, a number of people use these lakes. A lot of local people and people from miles around. Here you can see the main lake at Parkham Darren. There are three lakes actually on the visitor centre, um, but this one is the the main the main one that's to be used. The other one is a quarry lake, and the other one then is a, a nursery lake. Uh, which stores the fish. There's some beautiful areas to sit down and have some picnics. Just walk through the woods 
or just walk around feeding the ducks and playing with the children. I hope you enjoy this uh, video uh, we've made of uh, going to Isaf. Um, all these shots were taken within a window of two hours or within 15 minutes walk of the holiday cottage. Please don't hesitate to give us a ring or contact us via email if you want further information on what the cottage provides and the tariffs. Telephone number is 01443 820 Mobile 079 432 You can visit us on our website www.kairfillycottage.co.uk Or you can contact us via email our email address is lidog166 at aol.com. Myself and Julie uh, certainly hope you've enjoyed this uh, little video that we've put together. Um, hopefully it's prompted you to, uh, to contact us and perhaps think of staying with us in the beautiful village of Derry. Thanks for viewing.